Hi Pisces, welcome to your June 2023 general tarot reading. Thanks for joining me. My name is Michelle. This is for Sun and Rising signs. Pisces, my lovely water sign. Let's see, what is the energy of Pisces, please? For the month of June 2023 for Pisces. What is going on for Pisces? Pisces, Sun and Rising for the month of June. Okay, we've got third quarter moon here. Adjustments are required. Okay, so thinking on the fly, not being rigid in your thoughts, making adjustments as you go along. Let's take a look and see what your spirit animal is for the month of June for Pisces, please. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, I'm going to take both of those. They, they did come out together and I feel that they are connected. First off, we've got the lynx. Now, this is about um, the need to watch, uh, perhaps be more of a high priestess energy, withdraw, um, be the observer. Nothing can deceive you when you observe. Now, the, the thing is, um, people who try, or, or you know, I'm going to use the term people, you know, uh, usually it, it's people that deceive us rather than a situation. People, how do they deceive? Well, they do it by, uh, think, of, think of the magician on the stage. What, what does he do? He, he, he gets your attention over here while he does something over there, right? And that's the trick. I get somebody doing that. I get uh, somebody who says, look over here, Pisces, but meanwhile over here, uh, they, that's, the, that's what they're doing. So you may be being deceived. You may need to step back and, and really look in order to discover uh, the truth about someone around you. Uh, if you have any kind of instinct, instinct or intuition around someone around that is um, around you and you're thinking, oh, that doesn't seem quite right or that doesn't, that doesn't ring true to me, uh, there's a need here to step back so that you can see. See other secrets. Okay. And in that, uh, in that silence, you'll find strength. Now, the raven here is the shaman. This is the magician. So I feel that you, you need to see the magician. There's a magician around you and you, you need to see what this person's actually doing. Ooh. Yeah. Okay. Deceit. I get to look over here, Pisces. Meanwhile, over there, they're doing something else. Mm. Okay. Let's see, what's going on around Pisces here, Spirit, for the month of June? Uh, seems to be this, this masculine energy. So it's someone who's coming in with, uh, with a lot of uh, romanticism, boldness, and I get fast moving energy. So you need to step back here and really see this person. They may be trying to rush things. They may be trying to confuse you. Mm. Yeah, this, this is the magician now. Let's see, message for Pisces, please. For June, for Pisces. What is the message here? Enthusiasm. Yeah, I feel that this person comes in with a lot of enthusiasm. Yes. Like almost chaotic or frenetic kind of energy. Yeah. Again, I get, think of the magician on stage. What, what tricks do they use to confuse, um, to make you believe one thing and when it's really another? So a lot of it is, has to do with enthusiasm. All right. The Pisces, goodness. All right, let's see. I've been meditating on these cards prior to coming online. So let's do a few more shuffles. And uh, let's get your energy. What's going on here for Pisces, please? For Pisces, for the month of June. For my water sign, Pisces. Yeah, you think that there's, there's just something off here. Something doesn't quite ring true. This person around you. And I think that you're quite correct. So let's see. The Ace of Pentacles, okay. So it seems like this um, around you there is an opportunity 
this is this is you so I feel that you are the opportunity for this person okay the knight of pentacles okay well you'll we'll see that this knight is carrying the ace there so yes you've got this opportunity it's coming in you seem to be going for it spirit says the best thing that you can do here is take this slowly to make sure that it's viable uh, to make sure that uh, that this is going to be something that's really for you give it time the six of swords in reverse here Pisces uh, tells me that you are giving it time okay uh, some of you may have thought you know what I don't really trust this I'm going to move on but then thought no I'm going to give it another try I'm going to give this person the benefit of the doubt you may have broken up with this person in the past or been but this person seems to be coming back to you here and you're thinking okay well maybe maybe they really are trying to do things differently the four of pentacles in the reverse okay yeah uh okay pisces just be careful guys just be careful i'm getting this this message from spirit about don't don't give too much to this person because i feel it's you that that has this pentacles energy around you uh, you may have a good job you may make good money uh, you may um, have money in the bank there's an energy here of being careful that you don't lose what you have um, something that you've built up in your own life some stability security because there is this person around you and i feel that they're a bit of a player guys yeah i feel that this is this person's a bit of a player um they're they're not as there's a lot of enthusiasm with this person but you don't see a lot of action um like towards their goals their dreams they may be more of a dreamer someone who talks a lot about what they want to do what they want to achieve but um, where's the proof that kind of thing the four of swords in the reverse you know i feel like this there's, there's an energy here of not wanting i feel like this person is acting very fast moving this person around you uh, it's sleight of hand it, it's it's to make sure that you don't see the truth you know, they're moving fast they're move, wanting to think wanting things to move along very very quickly and I feel it's you here Pisces that are saying no wait a minute let's put the brakes on here let's slow it down and we've got the king of pentacles I feel that that's you guys I feel that that's you male or female not a gender specific reading yeah I feel that you you're in a very stable position romantically and you've got this person that's around you that's wanting to move things very very quickly I've got the Emperor here as well again I feel that this is you gosh there's a lot of stability around your life uh, Pisces oh and the devil showing up yeah be careful be careful because I feel that this person will want to rush things they'll want to uh, they'll want to attach themselves to you very quickly they may see you as someone who is very financial um, you may even be wealthy uh, this person doesn't want you to see their secrets or their secret side uh, and I feel that that's why they're rushing things along here guys Ooh. oh okay all right that was okay this person has been that way in the past but it didn't seem to be they didn't seem to be getting too far with you so now they they're circling back around with this different tactic and we've got this adjustments being required they're adjusting their tactic and this time they're coming in with something more serious 
like before I think it was um, maybe just a sexual thing um, more of this player kind of energy they may have been uh, breadcrumbing you uh, not really giving you much they didn't see you as someone who was uh, they wanted to to be with long term well I feel that this this person is coming coming in this time with a uh, a significant offer a real offer it may even be like marriage or commitment or let's move in together let's share finances but spirit is saying be careful be careful um, be careful because you have a lot to lose because I feel it's you Pisces that has this uh, this nest egg or this this money you may have uh, you may have just gotten a new job or you may have uh, you're on the pathway to success yourself and this person wants to attach to you like a barnacle like they want to be along for the ride they want to be they want to attach themselves to be along for the ride because they see you as heading towards success Pisces ooh gosh let's get some advice for you guys advice for Pisces yeah if they're trying to rush things rush things through slow it down so you can see slow it down so you can observe uh, withdraw if you need to okay making a difference I feel that this person has been kept up at night uh, they may have even started to think about uh, you know what 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 happened between the two of you they may may cringe and think oh gosh I shouldn't have done that they, they do seem to be at pain they seem to be in pain about something that they did in the past maybe it was this maybe things happened very sexually very quickly with you And now they want to do things differently, my spirit guide is saying. Now they want to do things differently. They want to come in with more of a uh, commitment. But you need to make sure that this person isn't just coming in because they now see you as someone who is financial or financially wealthy. Advice here for Pisces, please, spirit. What am I grateful for right now? okay an abundance mindset yeah I feel a lot of you are abundant if you're not abundant already I feel that you're on the way and some of you may have got a job that's really really good paying or it may be a new job or you may have recently got a windfall maybe some inheritance whatever it is you you are in this this energy of abundance okay and uh, this is improving your health um, th this is this is improving your life I feel like your life is improving and I think that this other person wants to attach themselves because they see you as a an upgrade a level up an improvement and so that's why they're adjusting how they're uh, how they're dealing with you because they now they now see you as someone who wants to who they feel they, sh they need to attach their wagon to because you're on the, the fast track to success it feels it feels like that guys uh, Pisces a little bit of a warning here spiritually uh, to make sure that if you if you are bringing someone into your life to make sure uh, that you continue your focus on what's in really important to you right now which is this motoring on towards success uh, being grateful for the opportunities that you've been given in life at the moment which appears to be uh, quite good and uh, making a difference in terms of um, this is making a difference in terms of how you're viewing yourself you're seeing yourself quite confidently uh, this this windfall or this new this new job this security here seems to be making you feel quite good about yourself uh, it's making you feel very secure and there's a need here to be careful because you are in that uh, that abundance mindset in that successful kind of energy uh, be careful of people's motivations around you 
okay? Not saying not to trust everyone. It's just a matter of trusting your instincts, trusting your intuition, people's motivations when they're around you, because you will attract this magician type of energy. And I feel it's this wand person. If you step away from anyone who's trying to move things along quickly and observe, um, nothing can deceive you. So trust your instincts, trust your, your ability to, uh, to discern uh, who has uh, good intentions and who doesn't. Yeah. If this person has shown themselves, has shown a side of themselves to you in the past, don't believe it. You know? um, something that you see can't be unseen. Okay. And I feel that there's an energy here of um, finding your strength, finding, your, finding yourself in a strong position, which is giving you the ability to reflect on people who are good for you and people who aren't. Yeah. Hmm. Interesting. Interesting, guys. I'm going to leave it there and wish you all the very best with this Pisces. Please do take care. If you'd like a personal reading, you can email me, gypsyinsights at gmail.com. I'm also getting this, guys, with this card of enthusiasm. You're finding yourself in, in, a, in a place where you're feeling a lot, lot more stable, secure and happy. Trust in that. Trust in that. Because I think that that's, that's your spirit guide tapping you on the shoulder and, and saying, hey, look, you, you, Pisces, you know, you've, you've got a pretty good here and, and it's going to get better. So make sure that you don't fall back into some old pattern uh, with, with an ex here or somebody that's around you that you know is toxic. Okay. So, Pisces, thank you so much. If you do press that thumbs up button before you go, share me on your social media. And if you're a newcomer, I would love to have you subscribe. Please do consider hitting that notification bell and be sure to check out the rest of my channel for more uh, messages. Thank you to my podcast listeners on Apple, Spotify, Amazon Music. And thank you as always to my regular viewers. You guys are the best. Pisces, I thank you so much. Please do take care and bye for now.